can now. Hello, everybody. <laughs> I know you need me between Christmas and New Year's Eve, so I give you a little bit, couldn't bring it over my heart to leave you alone without piano practice. Drone, lick. And going back to C with the, with the blue scale idiom. And the student very often is like, a, has a block. He thinks, no, I can just play here. He's very fixed for safety reasons. Um, recently, I played some um, uh, Dr. John, and he played something like this. And I thought, well, I could do a lesson of that. That's quite a, it's a new little rhythmic thing. It sounds great. Like, you know, what is this rhythmically? So this is what this lesson is about. And we will start with uh, a little uh, neighbor of that, a little uh, a smaller brother, like. And we'll have a look at the uh, little thing here. Um, here, uh, let's have a closer look. And first, we leave out the, the the slide to make it clearer. And we have a look at where the anchors are, where the two hands meet. Uh, here. That is the trick. So we have this one and two, t and this one, the second one is coming on, on t. That means it has a little bit of cross rhythmic feeling and we want that. Especially since we are crossing the rhythm of the years, right, uh, in a couple of days. One and two, t and three and t and it goes on like that. We just add the little slip note. And we just do two of those. Do it with me. One and two two and three and four two and one. sound because it's crossing uh, the borderline I was just about to say it's uh, for borderliners yeah no it's uh, 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 the border the borders of the bars the borders of the bar it's a bar borderliner okay now uh, we do something we uh, put something behind it give it context sounds great come on Now, if you have that, why not make it a longer line? You know, if you have something more to practice, you're probably all still totally fed up from, uh, like physically fed up uh, from Christmas and you need to burn calories. And uh, every single uh, note you play is burning um, about 0 0.00073 uh, calories. So, and you just play fast and play, you manage more notes and you'll be, be slim uh, as you always wanted for uh, in just a couple of days. So this is a diet. It's a piano diet. Just a little tail at the end. Can burn the uh, you can <laughs> you get okay now I try like a, a triple uh, what's it called uh, triple multitasking talking and playing and changing to F okay you can play this on F because it's just uh, minor blues scale material so.
here if you want. Play it on G now. Sounds good, huh? And now um, let's let's see the um, the the brother I played before. I played. I heard Dr. John played in a boogie woogie like. Of course, he played this as with three notes. If you're advanced, you can do this. Oh, I gotta get my uh, my tea bag out. Otherwise, I'm gonna do some self poisoning online here. Uh, my Earl Grey is just getting too strong. Okay, uh, as I said, he plays it like this. It's the way um, only he and me can play it. Uh, we do it like this, and it's just the same. We can use this thing also um, on this one. Sounds also great. And then, of course, on other notes. Here. One and two. Okay, we do first the, uh, this thing here. Yeah. If you have like a petite small hands, so sorry for you, um, then you just do it with a thumb. I don't have to recount it because you know it from here, it's just the same, okay? So. Oh, let's recall uh, what we did here. Yeah, nice little line. We use our, um, the glorious Royal thirds here. Yeah, this one. And we um, divide this one in two uh, triplets. And four. And one. And two. two and three. Da, 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 da. All trips. All trips. <laughs> all triplets. All trips. Three. And four. And one. And two. Three, four, and one, two, three, four, and now. Uh. Ooh. We stay on C, we stay on C. Now, okay, your your mind, I can hear you think. I can see it even on my display. I have a special app here that can read your mind. What do we do on F? Because now we are not only in blues, in minor blues ter territory, because we have the E here, which is not in the minor blues scale. What do we do here on F? Let's see. Uh, and then uh, I must think myself, something I'm not used to. Hmm. Uh, I think what he does, no, he just plays it on, he just uh, plays this lick uh, on, um, on, he just plays it on the subdominant uh, and then he plays something else. So what we could go with this one, the first part we can play on F, no problem. We just uh, move it up and we solve the problem with the E, we play. You can uh, transpose the whole thing to F, like, and this is a little bit tougher here because we don't have this slight, uh, this third finger uh, that just needs to slide down. We have, we need two, uh, two fingers here, the index finger playing the B and we're going to C. So again. I stay. And I stay. Okay. Of course, this is an eight bar form. This was just for practice staying uh, for five and a half bars on F. We don't usually do that. Uh, if you want to, in if you insist on a 
can now split the figure if you want, if you want to play this over an eight bar, uh, over a 12 bar form, you can play the first bit on G. Yeah, and now it since it's a, uh, a two bar pattern, we have to split it between the G7 and the F7. And then the F bit. And now, sounds great. I wouldn't usually, I mean, for practice reasons, you do it. You, you can do it on all, all three uh, chords, but in reality, and you know, this is not reality, this is just YouTube. I would just um, maybe play it on C and F, that's fine, and on G would play, maybe, maybe play something different. Maybe I would just like Dr. John, and he's the doctor, I don't have a title, academic title even, uh, just play it maybe on the, just on the one, you know. Uh, something else whatever now let's see if we can use that um, uh, if there's another spot where we can use that hmm um, let me think I'm not quite sure actually um Yeah, 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 yeah. We have it here. Then you can do, of course, whatever you like. You can, uh, or whatever, uh, uh, drone lick, whatever. Why not? That's a nice one. I I'll show it to you. In this case, you play this one with the second finger. Why do you play this with the second finger right here? not with the third because we want to have the fifth finger ready for the drone lick going from here uh, for the our two five mechanism the two five ultimate here second finger yay You remember this, huh? Shall we refresh it? Okay, I'll give you a brief refresh. One. And now, in triplets, we go from here, G flat, from C. Subscribe to my channel. We did this uh, a couple of times already, and uh, that would keep me, prevent me from explaining the same thing over, over again for the newbies. You know, look at my old stuff. Um, so we have this, uh, the G flat, C, F, and I call this a 2-5 business. I know it's a really stupid name, but it describes what it is. We have the uh, second finger, the two, finger two and finger five. And uh, this just keeps going here from uh, on these. We have 2-5 setting over, so it's really 2-5. It's a descriptive name, it's not very intelligent. Okay, so. So even if you have like two fingers, uh, cut off by your wife because you have been a naughty boy and then uh, you can still play it okay okay let's see now um Yeah, this would be like for a more happy uh, uh, um, approach. You know, it doesn't have that minor blues feeling, but insisting on the on the major third. Uh, hold on. Not my favorite. Uh, I, I leave it here. No, that's not my favorite. I like it here, and I like it here, and I like it here. So we did. Did we do this one? We did this one. We did this. This one we did not do. But I, then I would prefer this one. Okay, and very soon I'm going to make a tutorial 
on how we can play this freely without counting. Next step a hand independence. Stay tuned. Because now we manage we manage the uh, tremor lowering. And I'm gonna take the next step with you with hand independence coming soon, uh, in beginning of January probably, where we will use um, our learned hand independence hand independence to play something like you know, uncounted. Very important um, uh, 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 blues piano to a sound, and also this one. It's not counted. And stay with the left hand in, in timing. You see? I will, I will make an attempt. I will make an attempt. It will be a, a little task for you, but uh, this is uh, the blues piano sound. It will be hard over YouTube. So, now you have something a little bit, but I give you now an, a little bit of inspiration in the end. Uh, what else we could put in front of behind this uh, little uh, thing? Mm. Oh, great, it's just never getting boring. Okay, um, let's have a look. So we now. Let me just find out something, okay? Okay, shall we do this as a final, final uh, chocolate? Uh, are you as full with chocolate as, 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 as me, as I, as me, as I? Just had too much, must do sports, must do workout next couple of days to burn it down. Don't want to become a fat man. Uh, so, why did I mention that? Don't know. Okay, we do this. That's good. You know where this is coming, huh? We have these two 16th triplets, uh, uh, 16th in the middle. Everybody now. Everybody down. Too fast for It's uh, enough for a couple of days uh, as little food for you, non-calorie food, even if you're, you know, you're even losing weight playing this. Um, bye. See you in the new year.